All right, guys, so moving on to our next story, we're talking about some new characters in Jump Force. Now, there have been many announced, and I have to say, they're characters that, like, I'm shocked that it took this long to announce them, and frankly, I'm actually shocked that it's taking this long to announce, like, the, the game's coming out February 15th. Right. And they're still announcing characters. Now, I don't know when yeah. this specific video is going to come out, but we're live streaming this on our Twitch channel. So as of this recording, it's coming out. Like, I'm shocked that this is actually uh, going to be taking this long. But anyway, that they're actually taking this long and they're still releasing characters. But anyway, so the newest characters that we're here to talk about are, let's see here. There was uh, Naruto characters. Oh, God, I'm dying. Tristan, I'm dying. <clears throat> oh, no. Naruto <clears throat> characters. Uh, Kakashi, Gara, and a woman named Kaguya o uh, Otsu... Yeah, Otsutsuki. I don't know who Kaguya Otsutsuki is. I just know that she exists in the Naruto universe. So, yeah, and of course, Kakashi and Gara. And it is just so interesting that, again, and what like... About Boruto's dad? Right? Well, no, Boruto's dad was already announced. <laughs> uh, Boruto's dad and Boruto's uncle Sasuke were already announced. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sorry. I had to. <laughs> no, it's a good joke, but um, Boruto's uh, dad. Here's the thing, though, Tristan. A new character is Boruto. Yeah. And that's also very interesting that it took this long. I think that they're just trying to drum up so much hype that they will just wait to announce, like, anyone who will make us be like, oh, I need to get this game. Yeah. You know who I'm kind of salty about? Who? No, he -ay. Um, I actually don't mind that one. Let me explain. Right. Let me explain. Yu Yu Hakusho, while being very popular in the U.S. and in Japan as well, I'm not going to say it wasn't popular in Japan, that would be silly, um, it's a much older show. Yeah. Much older show. Looking at... Now, granted, I'm not saying that that many Naruto characters should be in, uh, but still, it's just a much older show. Naruto, while... Because here's the thing, too, right? Remember, Yu Yu Hakusho came out in the 90s. Here, it came out in the 2000s. Right. But in Japan, and this game is Japan-based... Came out in the 90s. So right. even uh, even something as popular as City Hunter was in Japan, which we talked about last time on Kikaku Corner, how many adaptations in Japan there are of City Hunter and how long that manga went on. And some of the adaptations came to the States, actually. But still, there's a reason why Ryo is the only one in City Hunter when maybe there could have been a villain they could have used or they could have used someone else. I'm unsure. But there's a reason why even with someone like Kenshido, you know, Ken from Fist of the North Star, they're like, yeah, Fist of the North Star, that, that's 40 years old. Let's just bring in Ken. Uh -huh. Everyone will make jokes and love it. And that's that, right? I mean, you you, you can't tell me that, because uh, I you, I know that you know this more than I do, Tristan. You can't tell me that they couldn't have included, uh, have included more characters from Roni Kenshin. They mm. probably could have. Yeah. Because right now they have Kenshin Himura and Makoto Shishio. Right. They probably yeah. could have included more. So... That's all I'm saying is that, like, it makes... What's interesting is from Black Clover, all we have is Asta, Asta. I don't know anything about Black Clover, but I feel like that one, it's like, that's too new that they haven't announced at least one villain from the show yet. That's interesting. Right. I'm assuming yeah. they have villains. Again, I haven't seen the show. I, I just know that it's shown it. Yeah, like, that yeah. seems to be what they, like, that would be the balance. You have a hero and a villain. At exactly. least, like, one yes. of each from a different series. Exactly. Or in the case of, you know, Naruto Sasuke... Sasuke has been like a rival villain on and off ish, whatever you want to refer to Sasuke as. Right. So, yeah. yeah. So I, I don't have a problem with no Hiei, but I do think that it is interesting that again, they're still waiting on some of these. Um, one, however, and this uh, two, however, and these are alleged spoilers. I'm just okay. going to tell you guys right now. I'm going to post the like picture, that. but the reason why is because someone is claiming that this is based off of Jump Force social media somehow, but there's no actual post, like maybe Jump Force social media deleted this or because right. it was posted on their Facebook. But again, you could see this elsewhere. I don't know why they wouldn't just link to it directly. So I haven't found this anywhere else other than this one picture that, again, could be faked because we've seen fake leaks before. There's been many. So I'm going to post the picture right now for you guys. Uh, that's not the picture. <laughs> Where's the picture? There we go. Found it. Okay. The leaks are Jotaro. There we go. And Dai from a Dragon Quest. Huh. DAI. For, uh, okay. Yeah, DAI from Dragon Quest. Um, but yeah, I know. Of course, you were like, of course Jotaro would be in this. Well, that was the funny part. I was going to be like, I was about to ask, has anyone from JoJo been announced? <laughs> And then I'm like, well, I mean, they have their own games, so maybe mm -hmm. they're like, we don't need Jump Force, but well, then I again, mean, ah, Dragon Ball. Well, no, I mean, not just Dragon Ball. I mean, dude, 
Dragon Ball, Naruto too. Dragon yeah. Ball, Naruto, One Piece, Bleach. They've all had fighting games. Yu yeah. Hakusho, um, Saint Seiya, uh, I mean, My Hero Academia. My Hero Academia just had one. Right. Yeah. But what were you going to say? Sorry, I interrupted you. No, it's going to, like, some of the others towards the end don't have as many as, like, you know, Dragon Ball or Naruto or Bleach or One Piece. That's true. That's true. Um, but anyway, so, uh, but looking at um, at these spo- potential spoilers, at these potential leaks, again, I they could easily be faked, you know? Yeah. But looking at them, uh, I have a question to ask you, Tristan. Why would Jotaro be chosen out of any other JoJo? Was he a popular JoJo? Because remember, they're on part five right now in Japan. Do you yeah. think he's popular or do you think that's when they were programming the game? Because, you know, these games are programmed like part yeah. four is airing. Uh, well, because part three aired two years ago, right? Or three years ago? Uh, Can you check when part three aired? On yeah. Japan, in Japan? I'm only bringing it up because obviously, I, I don't know if, he, if you knew Tristan, if like Jotaro was popular in Japan, maybe over other JoJo's. But I'm just wondering, because, you know, think about how long like a video game like Kingdom Hearts takes to be made. And then all yeah. of a sudden, no, certain, yeah, in certain worlds in Kingdom Hearts, you're like, wait, that movie came out. That's when this movie was popular. Like, I think Wreck-It Ralph is just somehow, like, it got lucky that, it, that a new one is coming out around the time, uh, you know, Kingdom Hearts 3 is coming out. Yeah. Uh, so the original release in Japan oh. looks to be from, yeah, 2014 to 2015. And this game is coming out now? Ah, yeah. I don't know if it took five years to make this. Yeah. Um, I hmm. mean, yeah, Part 3 was pretty big. Um, oh, the first time they introduced stands. Yes, that's what that, I was about to say. That yeah. might be why. Yeah. yeah. Huh. But what's interesting, though, is, and I'm not saying that these are completely false, uh, these leaks potential, but I'm wondering, again, we have two weeks as of this recording, maybe technically three if, if you want to say three weeks. When are they going to announce them? Right. And are there more characters that they've left to announce? Maybe, like, Dio is a villain that they haven't shown yet or something? Right. Uh, or yeah. DLC or who knows. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I don't know. So it's... I'm not saying that this is complete BS, but it is rather odd that these screenshots have come out from Bandai Namco's official Facebook and Instagram profiles. Right. And apparently they're in the form of sponsored advertisements. So I want right. you guys to post them down below if you're seeing this. Maybe if you've seen this around, like, no, Matt, look, here's our screen caps. I've seen this or something. I would right. love for you guys to get interactive with this and talk to us about it. But for me right now, it's just odd. Because here's the thing too, right, Tristan? Huh. When when it came to the Dragon Ball Super Broly trailer, we were fucking hit with that like a hurricane. Right. Fair. Those spoilers that we're not going to talk about here. Those spoilers, we were fucking hit immediately. Yeah. So this one, the fact that we haven't seen it yet is rather odd, to say the least. Because you have a yeah. Facebook. You don't really have a, you know an Instagram or a Twitter or anything like that. But you have a Facebook and you have a YouTube. They didn't say that these were on YouTube, but you have a Facebook. So these would have popped out at you, I think. Yeah, yeah. I don't think these would have, you know, gotten by you. So, yeah. And I've, I'm pretty sure I've seen ads for Jump Force on YouTube at times. Yeah. And, Maybe not and, yeah. so much recently, but I feel like I definitely have. Yeah, so I don't know, man. I'm not saying that this is BS completely, but I, I do wonder because, again, very convincing, you know, leaks have come out in the past very or convincing maybe not on youtube but uh crunchy roll there we go okay but no very convincing uh you know and again then they're not leaked right yeah like, but wait a minute but that looks so cool and then it's just not the actual thing someone just right. made it up because it's kind of that awkward it's like hmm jotaro i could believe that <laughs> i could definitely believe them putting him in it's not like you know, if it was like Jonathan, I'm like, mm, I love Jonathan, but mm-hmm. right, right, uh, right. He's the OG, but still, um, uh, yeah. It, it kind of makes me laugh because it reminds. I, I just seen a joke today. It was a Facebook post, but it was like, uh, uh, Tom Holland, you know, post entirety of Avengers four, you know, Endgame, and then there's like a tw- like a tweet or whatever from him underneath it, like. No, guys, like, I was seriously stressed. I was like, oh, shit, did I? <laughs> so it was like, on my Namco, it's like, oh, we've released these new characters. Shit, did we? <laughs> I, um, have you seen, like, Tom Holland has actually posted spoilers before. It's gotten really bad. 
Oh, no. I forgot what they were, but they were really bad. Well, uh, I, they're, not, they're not spoilers now because the movies are out, but like, yeah. he's done enough damage that mm-hmm. he was like half joking, half serious. Like, fuck, what did I do? Um, oh, all right. I, I wasn't aware of that. That's Whoops. why it's even funnier. Because right. that's why the joke is out there. Tom Holland accidentally posted the entire film online. Anyway, so either way, um, I would like to hear what you guys think about this. Do you think not only are these leaks legit, but also what do you think about some of the new characters that were introduced? Do you think that they should have been introduced sooner? And also I want to hear what uh, characters you want to be in the game as well. So I would love to hear all of this stuff down below. Uh, before we move on to our next story, though, I want to say that I was going to say a character from JoJo. Now that they're here, I don't know what to live for anymore. Mario. Um, Jump Force. Wait. Mario. No, I um, I don't know. I really don't. Maybe maybe something from a comedy anime if they want to make things like cute. Like, I mean, I think maybe they're trying to go for more serious stuff. But like maybe like uh, Aureli or Aurel from Dr. Slump. Right. Or maybe, yeah, because uh, this has to be Jump characters. It can't be someone from outside of Jump. The teacher from Assassination Classroom? Are they in it? No. Uh, okay. I, I don't know if they're showing in Jump. Are they showing in Jump? I... You know who I... Who I... No. <clears throat> Could have sworn, maybe, but... Saitama from One Punch Man. Even hey. though I think Even though I think they've confirmed he's not going to be in it. But Saitama. Uh, yeah. And, uh, yeah, and if... If, if they were part of Viz, which they're not, but if they were, I would love the characters from Pop Team Epic to be in this. Just something to make this fun and wacky and different. Right. That's what yeah. I'm saying. I want, like, one character to be, like, one of these things is not like the other. Because every fighting game has that one. I mean, you could argue Light is, but he's not... He's not, he's not playable. Like, he's not a gag character. He's... No, he's not playable. Oh. Remember? Oh. He's in it, but he's not playable. Right. That's the issue. No, hmm. looking at every single character, you could argue maybe Yugi is that character. Right, right. But, like, I want someone in this who were like, you. Like, I want that character. <laughs> Some people would claim that's... The rest of the roster just kind of, like, looks over and they're like, what? <laughs> the Some... one character just looks up, what? Guys, what? What? <laughs> Some people would say that's Asta from Black Clover. I would not. Mm. but some people would say he's that character but no but i really do want to hear what you guys have to say down below 